morning and welcome to Wednesday's maths lesson and I hope you've enjoyed our lesson yesterday on the value of coins and then matching the value of coins. Today we're going to do something similar but we're going to be looking at the value of notes that we actually use in this country and we use four different ones. So we have five pound notes, that's the smallest, ten pound notes, twenty pound notes and the biggest is a fifty pound note. Let's have a little look at the pictures. And you can see then on the notes is the value of each one. So we've got five pounds, 10 pounds, 20 pounds, 50 pounds. And the little sign in front of the number is for pound. So again, like yesterday, we're going to match the value. So let's choose 20 pounds. So 20 pounds and I'm going to check five, 20, 10, 50, so I'm going to draw a line. Then Dan has two £10 notes and one £5 notes. Circle the notes that Dan has. So you need to circle two £10 notes and one £5 note. Again, like yesterday when we were counting how many different types of coins, so how many £5 notes are there? How many £10 notes? So be checking the value of each note. How many 20s? How many 50s? Now this one is a comparison. So which is the smaller value? We want the smallest, not the biggest. So 5 or 20. So in this case, 5 is definitely smaller than 20. And you'll choose. Remember to be checking every time the value. Because some notes... Like 50 and 10 look a little bit similar. And then we've got our hungry crocodile. So we have got 10 pounds. Will it eat 10 pounds or will it eat 50 pounds? And you're going to write your symbol for whichever you think. Or is it equal to? Are they the same? And the last one, you might have a little bit of a challenge with Kim. So Kim has some money. I have a £30 note. Do you agree with Kim? Maybe go back to the front and check. What can you see there? Is Kim right? Talk it through with your adult helper if you're not sure and look for the clues. I'll see you tomorrow for more learning on money. Bye for now.